This is SAT test four, calculator section, question 29. College board is asking a complicated question. If x is the average, meaning arithmetic mean, add them up and divide by how many that there are of m and 9, y is the average of 2m and 15, z is the average of 3m and 18, what is the average of x, y, and z in terms of m? My preferred method here is to choose a particular value for m to make it simpler, since I notice that if I use m equals 0, all four answer choices are different, so the value that worked for m equals 0 is the correct answer for all m, it just makes the algebra into arithmetic. So x is the average of m and 9, so that would be 0 plus 9 over 2, since I'm choosing m equals 0. So that's x is 9 halves. y is the average of 2m and 15, so 0 plus 15 over 2, since I chose m equals 0, so that's 15 halves. And z is the average of 3m and 18. So 0 plus 18 over 2, because 3 times 0 is still 0 also. So that's 18 over 2 is 9. And then what is the average of x, y, and z? So I'll add up these three numbers and divide by 3. 9 halves plus 15 halves plus 9 divided by 3. 9 halves plus 15 halves is 24 halves is 12 plus 9 is 21, and that's divided by 3. So the average 21 over 3 is 7. Choice B is the only one that gives you 7 when m equals 0, so B must be the correct answer. Now I could also do this algebraically. It'd be uglier. The average of m and 9 would be x equals m plus 9 over 2, y equals 2m plus 15 over 2, z is 3m plus 18 over 2. And I want to average those three numbers, so that would be m plus 9 over 2 plus 2m plus 15 over 2 plus 3m plus 18 over 2 add them up, divide by 3. I don't like compound fractions where I have fractions in the numerator, so let's multiply by 2 halves. Anything over itself is 1, so I'm allowed to multiply by 2 over 2. And that gives me m plus 9 over 2 times 2 is m plus 9. 2m plus 15 divided by 2 and multiplied by 2 is 2m plus 15 and similarly plus 3m plus 18, and my denominator is 3 times 2 is 6. That's m plus 2m plus 3m is 6m, 9 plus 15 is 24, plus 18 is 42, all over 6. 6m over 6 is m, 42 over 6 is 7, I still get m plus 7, I think it's easier if I make up a value m equals 0 and turn this into arithmetic rather than slightly ugly algebra. Come back soon for my next SAT math video. With math, there's always more.